Joining me now to explain the raw power behind this new bomb, theoretical physicist Dr. Michio Kaku. How big is the Biden bomb? Well, it's a tactical nuclear weapon, not a hydrogen bomb. Hydrogen bombs are a whole other category. But this bomb is 24 times the power of the Hiroshima bomb. It'd be enough to flatten, for example, most of uh, New York metropolitan area if it were to be dropped right here. So we're talking about a, a pretty big punch in a tactical war. And then the question is what Ronald Reagan said, trust but verify. <laughs> if he allows us to come into our most nuclear uh, uh, secret facility, we should have the right to reciprocate and look at their arsenal. But he's not asking for that. <laughs> I have a feeling that's not going to happen. Do you get nervous when you think of the idea of Chinese nuclear science as kind of peeling around uh, Los Alamos? Yeah, because, of course, these are our crown jewels. Uh, this is the culmination of decades work, uh, worth work, uh, in terms of nuclear bombs. And we're just going to give it away. So <laughs> that's what Reagan said, reciprocate. Okay. We have to have the right to go to their facilities <laughs> to see what kind of weapons they're working on rather than being suckers and just letting them into our facilities. Why do we have a bomb this big? Well, in a tactical situation, you want bombs that are flexible, powerful, pack a punch at a very specific point. You don't want the bomb to go crazy. You want reliability. You want accuracy. And the bomb is called the B-6113. And this bomb is better than the B-61-7, which was not as accurate, didn't have as many safety protocols. Because when the war starts, you want the bomb to work. You want the <laughs> bomb to land where it's supposed to land, not go off course. All right. Thank you very much. And you were going to go into the nuclear industry. Yes, I was a student of Edward Teller, the father of the hydrogen bomb. He actually wanted me to design hydrogen warheads for the Livermore National Laboratory or Los Alamos. But I said no, because I wanted to work on an even bigger bomb, bigger than the hydrogen bomb. And that is the Big Bang, <laughs> the creation <laughs> okay. of the universe. All right. And you, and you, and you believe in God, kind of. I believe in the God of Einstein, <laughs> not the God that gives you a Christmas present uh, in a uh, Christmas All right, time. that's Santa Claus, doctor. Thank you very much. <laughs> hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.